Ah! I don't like long speeches. Ah! Ah! Hey, hey, hey. Welcome to my channel, everyone. I am the Global Cherry, and today we will be playing Hitman 3. If you'd like to see an interesting approach to games by Agent 47, subscribe, like the video, share the video, and turn on post notifications. We are fighting back. Me and 47. Let me tell you about my best friend. But we are closer than ever. We trapped the constant, Providence's chief controller. And finally, we traveled together in the desert. Partners. That's how way back we were. We down for. We lay the past to rest. Yes, it's time to lay the past to rest. Just maybe. Look towards the future. Are we gonna Tom Cruise this? Just skydive? It's time. It's time. I'm ready to feel the thrill. This is so cool! Ah, yes! Fly like an eagle! Do we have a parachute? We have a parachute, right? You know, I never planned this far ahead. You mean you didn't plan for a parachute? Ah! Wait, is that a beacon? Wait, that's a beacon? Oh no, no, no. Oh, we almost got shot to death. Oh, uh, my job is dangerous. This, Alexa Carlisle's helicopter just took off. Confirm target locations, over. Confirming, yeah, over. What's the status? Right. We have a situation. Oh yeah, Diana's voice. And I think I know why. We're in Dubai. Welcome to Dubai, 47. Ooh, the skyscraper looks so cool. Today is the inauguration of the scepter, and the ceremony is well underway. Agent 47 hates politics. You will find Marcus Stuyvesant near the building's signature art installation. While a paranoid Carl Ingram has ensconced himself in his penthouse suite, security on highest alert. Then we're going to have to dress up like the security. And ready to assist. Good luck, 47. Thank you, Diana. 47. Come in, 47. Do you copy? I'm here. 47 copies and is scared of heights. Good. Oh, we can drop down. Oh, oh these targets won't see what's coming. <laughs> it's evil, 47. Oh, what's this camera? <laughs> Did I just take a selfie? <laughs> Time to be slick. Climb up the building like a spider. Let's Tom Cruise this thing. Let's hang over here. Man, 47 must have gone through strenuous training. Let's drop down. Mm, locked. 47, use your camera and scan the lock, will you? Oh, it opened the window. There's controls from here. Man, our agency has the best technology. What a great investment. I'm in position. The inauguration is taking place close by. Once you've infiltrated it, get your bearings. Got it. Sure, there must be floor plans somewhere. Understood. There must we be floor plans somewhere. On this one. The only the problem, agency, is I can't we read. Them for good. We are so close, 47. Don't worry. They're not going anywhere. They're not going anywhere. Not on my watch. Are there any guards here? Whoa, they're everywhere. Can I join the party? Ooh, we're blending in so well. We need to eliminate two targets, Carl Ingram and Marcus Stuyvesant. Wow, this is great. You talk too much. I don't like you. I don't like you. Ah! I don't like long speeches. Ah! 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 No! No! Oh gosh! No, that's not what I want. Ah, save me! Ah! I guess the party ended very quickly. No! 
No! No! You'll never take me alive! No! I, ne I just don't like long speeches. 47 is so sensitive. They can't see me. <laughs> they cannot find me. I'm definitely not in the closet. 47 is a pro agent. They'll never find me here. Whoa, they're looking for me. What can Agent 47 do with his wiles? Listen, I want to talk to the partners directly. Make them understand why all of this is happening. Yes, talk to them. And that terminal gives me an idea. There's a server room near the Sheikh's personal reception. A server room? If access to it, we might be able to recover useful intel from it. Okay, let's go to we the server to work room. together to hack the system, but it's our best shot. If it's our best shot, we gotta do it. Don't talk crap about me because I'm bald. Okay, we're almost at the server room. There's a chance that there might be people in there. Time to commit more unarmed assault. There's a keypad lock on the doors to the staff area. One moment. All right, try this. Four, seven, zero, six. Four, seven, zero, six. Disguise as event security. Four, seven, zero, six. Oh, wait. There's quite a bit of security here. One moment. You ready for some more fresh air, 47? Oh, definitely. You didn't see anything. I'm not dragging your friend's dead corpse away. Okay, we have to hide this body quickly. No one will ever suspect Barcode Man. They won't even know their security guard changed hairstyles. I think I can open that window remotely. You can open that window remotely. Have a try. I want to take more selfies. Don't mind me. Okay, this can't be good. Oh, uh, yeah, ignore the door opening. Don't tell people to lock it. Uh, my hands are sweaty. Don't let go. Oh, uh, the target is in my hands. Sweet victory. Oh, I'm admiring myself in the mirror. Oh, I'm trespassing. Be behind one of the doors in this hallway. Go in here. Let's pick up a hammer. Let's silently attack him. Drag his body in the closet, disguised as maintenance staff. Oh, our plan is going so well. Let's put this man back in the closet. We're in the server room. What should I do? Let's use the terminal. Hmm, a calendar function. We can use this to summon the partners to a fake meeting, 47. We can summon them to All a right, fake I'm meeting. I'm a hacker like Olivia, but I think you need to pull one of the racks here to gain access to the terminal. One of the racks here? Oh no! Damn it. A silent alarm has been triggered. Security is on its way. Hide, 47. Crap! The security's here. Yeah, there's no issue with security. There's a rat here. I'm just cleaning the server room. Don't mind me. Why are you staying there? Nothing to see here. No, no, why are you in this room? Yes. Okay, that was a close one. Seven. Lucas, again, I don't trust we? you anymore. Ah, uh, I think I've got it. We'll need a key card to gain access. A key card? Someone in maintenance should have one we can borrow for a spell. Luckily, I am part of maintenance. Yeah, it's okay, be quiet. Hey, 
Let's just put you guys in the closet, shall we? No evidence. Let's put the girl in the closet too. Hitman cleans up after himself. He's a very sanitary criminal. Looks like we got our key card. Haha. <laughs> well, that must have done something. Can you see anything different in the room? Oh, this one is yellow. Should we press the button? Good. We're in. Now all you need to do is access the terminal and use the calendar option to summon the Providence partners to a meeting. Oh yes, let's rearrange the meetings. Good work. The meeting has been booked. The partners should be moving up here shortly. Great. Looks it's time like to meet them soon. Sealed off for private conversations. Handy. Handy. Now they won't know who I am if I kill someone in front of a camera by accident, of course. Ah! Drag him into the maintenance corridor. Okay, now I am one of the elite guards. Can I disable the cameras? Put him in the closet. Oh, shoot! Oh no, he caught me! Put him in the closet too! Oh no, more people are finding out about our crimes. Can we erase security footage or something? Ooh, a banana. Looking good today, sir. Looking good today, sir. Looking fun, looking flashy. Don't mind me. Oh, it's here, it's finally here. We need to find the lounge. Oh, they found the body. No, Hello, my targets. It's time to end this. Both targets finally, Stuyvesant are finally done for. Dude, that was easy. I killed both of them at once. This is a job for Agent 47. Uh, no issues, people. It's just a security issue. Agent 47 is finally gone. See you later. Woo! We're done the mission! Woo! See ya, suckers! I'm finally free! Another job done by Bald Barcode Man. The man behind the curtain. What other secrets is Agent 47 going to find? If that's your winning face, I'd hate to see you lose. We underestimated the cuts. I don't smile, yeah, he's a Lucas Gray. He's not just after the money. He wants it all. He wants all the money. Once, we we need to game. teach that greedy and pig. Well, we're not the ones who let him escape. You still don't trust her. Are you talking about Diana? I don't like executive decision makers. Look, you don't have to follow her, you know? What are you talking about? Soon, this will be over. Maybe it's time to think about the future. You have to face the possibility that there's no going back. What? If the to be free from this line of work? She'll make it right. She always does. What did 47 do you that made the ICA color? hate him? Come on. We've got a plane to catch. I hope you like the rain, 47. Of course I like the rain. 8047? How did you... I have everyone's number. You really oh, that's creepy. Now. You planned this. All of it. Don't Is that Carlisle? I just played the hand I was dealt. We'll find you. We'll find you and yeah. we'll kill you. Where'd that get you? We handed you an empire. It's for the best. The 
partners were complacent, set in their ways. But power is more than just security. We'll take down the Providence stupid company of Providence. Change. Surely you understand. Or you will. What things hold for Agent 47? Ah, yes. Are you ready to do this again, friend? Diana? Carlisle's lost an empire. But he made a new one. You tend to be reminded of what truly matters. I can't smile. My face so, is stuck this way. The end of the line. You ready for this? Uh, of course. Who will you be without a score to settle? I guess the world's most wanted fugitive will have to do. <laughs> no, the world's most wanted fugitives. Thornbridge Manor. Ooh, that the manor Carlyle looks beautiful. I can't wait to take them down. The Revenant Alexa Carlisle and her three adult children, younger brother. Damn, it's Zachary, like a museum here. And daughter -in -law. What a narcissistic woman. Carlyle's she has a whole portrait of herself. Curiously. Carlisle summoned a famous London PI soon after arriving this morning, but his purpose at Thornbridge is yet unclear. It's unclear. The target knows that you're coming, and her guard detail is top-notch. If so it's top-notch, it'll be easy for Agent 47. going in and out of the estate. Any appeal for backup is going to fall on very deaf ears. Good luck, gentlemen. It's another job for bald barcode man. The bald barcode man strikes. Is that a detective? I'm stalking my prey. I am the apex predator. Bald barcode man. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. You know why? People at grocery stores don't scan Agent 47's barcode? Because he's priceless. Let's go in here. You're going to meet Madame Carlyle. Well, <laughs> you're not going to make it to your meeting. Come here. Come here. Oh no. No. Wait, they saw me with the body. Oh no. Oh, oh, oh! No! They caught me! Oh no! Where are you going? Run! Run! I dare you! Run! Run! Yes! Yes! Feel my fists! Uh oh, 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 Stuff the man in the closet, ha ha ha, ho ho. I didn't kill anyone. Alexa Carlyle, I'm the detective. I'm here to investigate the mysterious Mr. murder in your manor. Coming on such short notice. No the problem, no problem. Upon us, and Let's have some tea alone in a room together. With absolute discretion. Results and discretion are my speciality. Very well. I suppose you will want to start at the crime scene. Yes, I want to start at the crime scene. Our examination of a potential crime scene is half the job done. Good. Fernsby will take over from here. I am Mr. Fernsby will take over from here. Madam Carlyle has asked me to assist you in any way possible. Mr. Wickham, okay, Fernsby. I understand that you've traveled from London. Would you care for some refreshments? Or do you prefer to go straight to Mr. Zachary's sleeping quarters? Let's start I the investigation. Start it as you wish. If you'll follow me, sir. Yeah, keep walking, Fernsby. Nice job, officers. Keep doing what you do. And I'll keep doing what I do. <laughs> I feel obliged to point out that current affairs surrounding Madame Carlyle are of a delicate nature. She's a you delicate flower. With the recent announcement of her death. You will probably learn that the staged funeral is scheduled to take place tomorrow. Scheduled. Children were not I already hate this, this morning, butler for saying the word scheduled. At all. What do you want to tell me? concerns the death of Mr. Zachary, Madame Carlyle's younger brother. He was found dead in his bed this morning. 
The door was locked from the inside, and a suicide letter was found in his room. A suicide letter? However, Madame Carlyle suspects foul play and will not accept that he took his own life. Let's start the murder investigation. A locked room murder mystery, 47. I trust you'll get to the bottom of this. Oh, I definitely will get to the bottom of this, Diana. Okay, Diana, let's look at Zachary's laptop. Let's check his internet history. Oh, oh, he has some good stuff Zachary on there. Was shopping for New Wellingtons last night. Not exactly what you would expect from someone suicidal. Hey, don't judge his fashion sense. He's a dead man after all. Why don't you use your camera to scan the dead body, 47? Diana, that's messed up. You want me to take photo of the dead body? That's part of my job description. Throat markings indicate a rare, short-lived plant poison killed him. He was Spread poisoned. Shows time of death at around 10 o'clock last night. You do know your poisons, 47. Of course I do. I'm the one using them. Ugh, look at this handsome guy in the mirror. Oh wait, stop being narcissistic, let's go. This is an interesting balcony. Sir. It'll be a shame if someone fell. It wouldn't be good to see someone fall to their death. Ah, it's so tempting. I really want to push you. Hey! Woo! Is that a bookshelf? Did we unlock a secret passage? This family is evil. What's this piece of paper? The mansion floor plan. This could be useful. The floor plans. Somebody's been researching the secret ins and outs of Thornbridge Manor. Someone smarter than Agent 47. A search of the crime scene 47. Maybe it's time to see the butler. I'm curious about the information he's prepared for you. Oh, I'm curious too, Diana. You won't believe the discovery I've made. Carlyle was a pervert. Oh, if only the target was standing underneath this beautiful chandelier. And only if there weren't so many witnesses. Have you read the latest news recently? It looks like she hasn't read the latest article. Bald barcode man strikes again. It's a very insightful article. Mr. Fensby, I have something to report to you. Feather duster. I'm done examining the crime scene. Zachary died around 10 o'clock last night. Well, that means the staff were off duty. And Madame Carlyle and her security didn't arrive until this morning. Which means someone knew access to Madame the manor. And myself, as the only persons here when he died. And before you ask, no, I do not have an alibi. I was alone in my office at the time of death. We'll see about that, Butler. It's a list of the possible suspects and their quarters. Hopefully that will help you keep track of your findings. Please come and see me when you've solved the case, and I will take you to Madame Carlyle. I'll be solving the case. I'm here to solve a murder mystery. Detective Barcode Man is here. He plays the strings of my heart with that piano. I can feel the hair on my neck stand. This man, is he one of the suspects? He plays the piano well, but is it his last song? Excuse me, Edward Carlyle, can you tell me about your whereabouts? Last night. Oh yes, this dreadful business with Zachary. I stay at the local inn. You see, I you have a business with Zachary. Thornbridge Manor. Mm. I smell something fishy. Can you tell me about Zachary's behavior last night? I certainly didn't expect him to commit suicide. Or this suspect here reading a newspaper. Gregory Carlyle, explain Can you yourself, tell me please. Where you were yesterday evening. Oh, you're wondering about my alibi, Mr. Detective. Well, um, I left Thornbridge around half eight for a pint with Edward. I wish I hadn't. <laughs> Quiz night at the inn. On the other hand, staying here with Zachary, my obnoxious sister, and the wife sporting another one of her headaches would have been a fate worse than death. <laughs> uh, the, the short of it, uh, Zachary was very much alive when we left. This snobby rich I family attitude will be the end of me. Back here just before midnight. He's better off dead. Hmm, someone who has prejudice against his mother. And said Zachary was better off dead. I'm still putting you on my suspect list. Looking good, looking good. Looking good, he <laughs> he. Huh. Enjoying the fresh air? Ha! <laughs> the barcode man strikes again. No one will find the body. <laughs> no one. Oh, great timing. I needed to question you, Rebecca Carlisle. 
Rebecca Carla, can you tell me about yesterday evening? We don't really see much of each other, my brothers and I. I suppose it takes our mother's funeral to bring us together, and even then, it's not like we sit on each other's lap. Well, you're not really that close Let's with see. your family. Patrick, Gregory's son, disappeared straight after dinner. Why is this family so large? I think he might be in some sort of trouble. Edward wanted to go as well, but Gregory convinced him to stay for a few drinks before they went off for a pint at the local ah. at quarter to nine. And one more thing. Yes? Please be kind to Edward. He can only take so much. Oh, you're Is such a kind sister. I do admire how much you care for your brother. But I am a hitman. Hitman has no emotions. Where were you yesterday I'm evening? A suspect. I mean, you are a suspect. Everyone. Well, I spent the evening with my family, but I got an awful migraine and had to take to bed. Everyone Yeah, right. As if you had a migraine I and went to I bed. Went up when the boys sat down for a drink around eight o'clock. That music makes my wow. I just wanted to clean something up. No, no, no. Off you go. What was that sound? Go check it out, Edward. Great. That was his last song to play. Ready for something sharp? You didn't see this coming. The barcode man strikes again. I am a smooth criminal. A few so. What does that do? Don't mind me, it's just part of the investigation. Is that a greenhouse? Family photo. And I need it to be perfect. Let's follow the photographer. I want to do his story. Oh, he's here. Need help. Oh crap! Quick, I have to think fast. Right in the head. You are one sick. Try running away from this. Let's go in the bush. You didn't see anything. We need to power up the camera flashes, you know? I wanna do this story. Let's insert the fuse cell. Let's go test out your picture, shall we? We need to make sure Alexa Carlisle has the most beautiful portrait ever. Look at the camera. God, I have to take it again. It you must have quite the portfolio. I'm ready for the shoot. Perfect. I'll call yes. the family down now then. Excellent forty-seven. Let's sabotage the water. Let's create a nice leak. Shoot. Let's see if any memorable moments will play out in front of the camera. Is the family coming out? Ah, lovely. We're about to take the most amazing portrait of one for the ages. <laughs> ah, I can feel the target. She's approaching close. Does no one notice that the photographer no longer is here? They don't even know the difference between the photographer and Agent 47. The barcode man will get his cue and he'll become the ultimate apex predator. <laughs> I expect you to be efficient. I have a lot to see to today. I'll do my best. I'll do my best. I expect you to do yours as well. <laughs> yes, approach the chair. Yes. I understand that you have a lot of questions. Please be patient for a little longer. I will address you in the sitting room afterwards. Right. Get How long are you gonna wait? Let's get this over with. Let's get this over with. Yes. Yes, approach the chair, There's madam. A of water here. Oh, there were some Just get this done, shall we? Technical issues. Somebody get the doctor. I think someone really badly. You're going to have to sit down on the chair anyways. Three, two, one, say inheritance, because that's what your children are about to get. <laughs> Wait, do we do it? That's Madame Carlyle taken care of. 
It wasn't me. I didn't do anything. Arthur Edwards. Time to get the file indeed. So what's been going on here? Alexa Carlyle was murdered? Oh, that that's terrible. I found one crowbar. Maybe it can help us out? Yep, no one saw me in here. Let's repair the distillery kit. Ooh, we can produce poison. Ah, yes. Hitman's favorite subject, science. Good day to you. I'm here to give you today's newspaper. Gracious courtesy from Barcode Man. What other goodies is she hiding? I don't know who you think you are, sir, but I'm not letting you pass. God damn it. Maybe we can dress as a bodyguard? Huh? No one ever taught you any manners. Of course they taught me manners. But my manners as a hitman is to eliminate my targets. <laughs> Another victim in my grasp. Hey, you don't remember me, right? It's a hell of a uniform you got there, guy. Thanks, guy. You'll never know where I am. Oh, my reflection scared me. Let's put lethal poison vial in here. She's communicating with that guard, huh? I'm just staring at the door, ma'am. The door is fascinating. You should have some tea to drink. Drink it. Drink it. You are a risk to everybody. There's a letter to Rebecca Carlisle. No one saw anything. Yeah, yeah, stuff him in the closet. You were a problem, but you're not a problem anymore. Now you can talk to the maid in the afterlife. How do I find Alexa Carlyle's office? Oh, I guess I found her office. It's a nice day out, isn't it? Let's put you in the box. Don't do what? Act suspicious. Oh, this painting is so sus. I see this lady glorifies her dog too much. Of course I'm a dog person, but still. You're in my space. Oh, I didn't mean to be in your space. I just like being around you. I just like being around you. This poor man. He will fly soon. I'll make your dreams come true, buddy. You will fly, but you need to train yourself. Go! I'm giving you a push to follow your dreams. This woman has been hiding so many secret passageways and other secrets in this home. Man, this is another level. This woman is nuts. After a while, I finally found the code. 1975. Oh, it is the password. We finally got the case file. Mission complete. Well done, 47. Diana, what's happening? See ya, suckers! Haha! <laughs> Eat dust! Yes, I'm free! I'm finally free! Don't respond, just listen. Just Diana, listen? What's going on? Did Diana get captured? Lucas Gray, what's going on? Looks like the story's getting more interesting. And then there were oh, the voice I missed. Thank you, Miss Burnwood. Now, it's my turn. Shoot. Is that the constant? We should have killed you in the Ark of Society. No, my friend Lucas. Stay down. Boss wants you alive. Yeah. How about now? Over here. Cover me. He's dead. Oh wait, is that 47 disguised? Walk away. <laughs> or what? You going to take us all on? 
Oh no, Adrian! Don't. Tell the constant to start running. No. You think you've won? Forty-seven is out there, and forty-seven never misses his mark. Yes, he Either never misses. Wormwood. That's what makes you valuable. Your delusion. Are you kidnapping her? You think her? I would betray forty-seven? Trust me. Yeah, Diana will I'm never betray me. Nothing. What is this? I told you we could help each other, and I meant it. I look forward to your call. You're turning my friends against me. Oh wait, is that 47's Pray contract to assassinate Go Diana's to parents? And stay out of sight. Agent 47 is alone again. Aww. That is all for today for Bald Barcode Man. If you enjoyed the video, please make sure to subscribe, like the video, share the video, and turn on post notifications. Especially if you want to see more of Bald Barcode Man. Thank you for watching, and that's all. Woo! Bye!